Today, we're gonna be stick welding some aluminum cans. Let's go. 4043s, 3.30 seconds. Let me know what it is you want me to try to weld next. Also, upcoming videos, I'm gonna, I'm gonna start trying to, also upcoming videos, I'm gonna be welding, stick welding, with like nails, rusty nails and screws that I find, and I'm gonna see what it does. If you like that kind of worldy stuff, stay tuned, stick around. Don't forget to hit that like, smash, and subscribe. Poisey Will. Why would I use 4043 stick welding for aluminum? Easy. Sometimes when you're out in the field having to do a repair, you don't have the luxury of bringing in your gases or a MIG machine or a TIG welder. It's kind of difficult to get up way up on those spots with a TIG machine or a, weld or a MIG welding machine. There's usually Stick welding is the way to go and field repairs. Besides, when a windy day like this, how will you ever accomplish the repair you're trying to do? 4043 electrode for aluminum stick welding. For arc welding aluminum, DC only electrode positive. So you have to switch your polarities. If you haven't already, go ahead and do that. This electrode likes to be ran from 50 to 80 amps. We're gonna go ahead and adjust that. Let's set up. 50 amps and then our ground needs to be on the positive and our electrode needs to be on the negative and that's how we're going to switch out our polarities simply unscrew and switch them You got a layer of something right away. I have to clean that.
to go ahead and try some good old Texas TIG. Let's see how this goes.